In this video, we are going to count down in no particular order behind the voices of the Harry Potter Celebs Collection. Number 11, Harry Potter. Harry Potter is played by Daniel Radcliffe. Radcliffe, also known by his full name, Daniel Jacob Radcliffe, is an English actor, best known for playing Harry Potter in the Harry Potter film series. So basically, if you don't know him, I don't know why you clicked on this video. Anywho, not only that, he also plays as Rex Dasher, a secret agent. To your service. My enemies have eyes and ears everywhere. This way. I'm Hermione Granger, and you are Ron Weasley. Pleasure. Number 10, Ron Weasley. Ron Weasley is played by Rupert Grint. Grint, also known by his full name as Rupert Alexander Lloyd Grint, is an English actor that rose to fame for his role as Ron Weasley one of the three main characters in the Harry Potter film series. Not only that, he also played as Amadeo in Underdogs, so it wouldn't become confusing. The movie is also called The Unbeatables for the US dub and in the US dub, the name Amadeo is changed to Jake for the localization. The movie originates from Argentina, who mainly speaks Spanish. And also for the record, Grint voiced the UK dub for the movie. But for the UK dub, the name wasn't changed to Jake. Got it? Good. Continuing forward, another movie that he voiced is Josh in Postman Pat the movie. For him, voicing Josh for the movie wasn't that hard, even though he played as Ron for almost 10 years. It even helped that he looked so similar to Josh. Just a reflection of him, I suppose. Number 9, Hermione Granger. Hermione Granger is played by Emma Watson. Watson, also known by her full name as Emma Charlotte Dure Watson, is an English actress and activist that has changed recognition for her roles in many blockbusters and independent films, most notably in Harry Potter and Beauty and the Beast playing as Belle. Not only that, she also played as Princess P, a human princess who befriends Desprio in the tale of Desprio. It's very exciting for Emma to play in this movie as this is her first time voicing an animated movie. It's a weird experience voicing P because she needs to voice the character by herself alone in a dark room. So she needs to be more imaginative about how she acts. <gasps> Are you a rat? No. What are you? A mouse? You're a strange little mouse. Thank you. Come on. Number 8. Dumbledore. Dumbledore is played by Michael Gambon. Michael, also known by his full name as Sir Michael John Gambon, is an Irish-English actor best known for his classic works in the London theatre. Not only that, he also voiced Franklin Bean in Fantastic Mr. Fox and Uncle Pastuzo in Paddington. For him, voicing characters is very easy. Just do it, he says. That's what acting is, even with his old age and memory loss. He still does characters in acting. What a great guy. Fabulous! Why is it always me? Number 7, Neville Longbottom. Okay, Neville Longbottom is played by Matthew Lewis. Lewis, also known by his real name as Matthew David Lewis, is an English actor best known for his role in the Harry Potter film series. Not only that, he is also known for his role as Nigel, the son of a sex-crazed mother, to say it lightly, in The Night of the Loving Dead, a short animated film about love and zombies, which won an award for Best Short Film in the St. Albans International Film Festival. Dry up, Dursley, you great prune. <laughs> Number 6, Rubius Hagrid. Rubius Hagrid is played by Robbie Coltrane. Coltrane, also known by his real name as Anthony Robert Macmillan, is a Scottish actor, writer, and comedian, best known for his performances on stage and on screen. Not only that, he is also known for his role in many animated movies, starting from Lord Dingwall, a short-tempered authoritarian character in Brave, 
Griffalo in the title character of the movie, The Griffalo, and Gregory, a large hulking person who stays in the dungeon and oversees the prisoners in the tale of Desprio. For Coltrane, in the movie Brave, he felt that it was kind of a stretch playing an old and short Scottish person, but he went through with it. Number 5. Professor Snape Professor Snape is played by Alan Rickman. Rickman, also known by his real name as Alan Sidney Patrick Rickman, was an English actor and director known for his deep, languid voice performing in many famous theaters. Not only that, he is also known for his role as Joe in Help. I'm a Fish, a Danish-German-Irish traditionally animated science fantasy musical film released in the 2000s. A sad fact about his movie is knowing about his death in 2016 because of a minor stroke and pancreatic cancer. Aaron Paul, who was actually one of the artists who co-stars this movie with Rickman, would later again meet Rickman in another movie in 2015 I in the sky. I regret Paul has was not to spend time and meet Rickman. I don't understand. Is that bad? It's bad. Good evening. Number 4. Professor Minerva. Professor Minerva is played by Maggie Smith. Smith, also known by her real name as Dame Margaret Natalie Smith, is an English actress that has had an extensive career on film, stage, and television, best known for her role in Downtown Abbey. Not only that, she also played as Lady Blueberry in Gnomeo and Juliet, then reprised her role in Sherlock Holmes for the recording sessions for the movie. The stars mostly didn't see the other co-stars for the whole production. The only time this happened was the recording session for Maggie Smith and Michael Caine, which they both had a banter for one scene. Most of the other stars work from different parts of the world, from the US, London, and Paris. So lots of voice shenanigans. Number 3. Draco Malfoy Draco Malfoy is played by Tom Felton. Felton, also known by his real name as Thomas Andrew Felton, is an English actor and musician best known for his role in the Harry Potter series. Not only that, he is also known for his role as Grey, a wolf who is desperately in love with another wolf called Bianca in Sheep and Wolves. The movie was originally made in Russia, so when it got to the English dub, the voice company, which produces the dub for the movie, announced that Tom Felton and a slew of of other actors are going to voice the dub for the characters. Don't touch anything, Draco. Yes, father. Number 2. Lucius Malfoy. Lucius Malfoy is played by Jason Isaacs. Isaacs also known by his real name as Jason Michael Isaacs, is an English actor best known for his role as Michael D. Steele in Black Hawk Down and of course Harry Potter. Not only that, he is also known for many animated movies, playing as Dick Bastardly, one of the main villains in Scoob. My friends call me Dick. Okay, Rick. Leland Turbo, a British intelligence agent, working Finn McMissile in Cars 2, and Dracula in Monster Family. For the movie's cube, a way for him to be comfortable with the booth was to honestly have fun. Tony, who is the director of the movie, has an infectious laugh and made him go over the top with the character. Honestly, if everyone is having fun, they would give a great result. Number 1. Voldemort Voldemort is played by Ralph Fiennes. Fiennes, also known by his real name as Ralph Nathaniel Twistleton Wycam Fiennes, is an English actor, film producer, and director best known for his role in Schindler's List and of course Harry Potter. Also, wow, that's a long name. Anywho, not only that he also played in many animated movies as Ramsey in The Prince of Egypt, Barry and Doolittle, Alfred in the Batman Lego movie, 
Victor Quart and Wallace and Gromit, The Curse of the Were-Rabbit, and finally Raiden the Moon King in Kubo and the Two Strings. For him, in the movie The Batman Lego Movie, he felt that local performance is the key for animation. He felt that being physical in the booth is the best thing to release his voice per se. He felt that the script is witty and enjoyed the experience. Master Bruce, you live on an island figuratively and literally. Yeah, I love it. You can't spend the rest of your life alone, dressed in black, listening to angry music and staying up all night. Yes, I can, because I'm Batman. Thank you so much for watching until the end. Subscribe to this channel and leave a comment down below. Like the video and we will randomly give a shout out to one of you at the start and the end of the video. For today's shout out, we are going to shout out this comment. So with that, see you all in the next video.